G'day and welcome to the Tech Math Channel. What are we going to be having a look at in this video today? It's just a, it's a peculiar little maths trick um, for multiplication. It's a, it's a really good little one. So I'm just going to uh, see if you can figure it out. Um, I will obviously give you the uh, secret with this, but it's a really good one for working out numbers instantly, like of uh, multiple digits of working out this multiplication. So I'll give you an example. Uh, what about this one here? I'll get you to work out, see how fast you can work out 59 times 51. Um, look, I reckon you should actually be able to work that out instantly. The answer to that is 3009. Okay. Yeah. Did you see how I worked that out? Maybe, maybe that one was a little bit too hard for you. What about I'll give you a different one? I will give you the, how we do this, by the way, so don't get too uh, upset by this. What about uh, 42 times 48? Can you automatically work out the answer to that? Did you get the answer of 2016? You might say, how am I doing this? What's the secret? Now, look, this is a it's a fairly uh, limited little trick, but it's a, it's a good little trick nonetheless, and I'll, I'll show you how this works. First off, you're going to notice a couple of things about these numbers, and these two conditions are critical for doing this particular little maths trick. First off, you're going to notice that these two numbers that I'm multiplying, the start of them is the same. You notice that? The other thing you might notice is this. These two numbers here add up to 10. Now, these two conditions have to be met for this maths trick to work. Okay, so I'll show you how you use this to actually work out uh, our answer, okay? So, as I said, it's a, it's a fairly limited trick, but it's a, it's a good one anyway. So, first off, what we do when we're doing these, this particular trick is, we look at the number here, in front of, the, these, we look at these two numbers, and we go one number above it. So, the number above 4 is 5. And then we multiply these two numbers to get our first digits. Alright, so 5 times 4 is 20. Then with our last two numbers, to get our last two digits, what we do is we multiply these two numbers, okay? 2 times 8, 16. Yeah, pretty cool, yeah? What about I'll, uh, I'll give you another one of these. So, what about we do this particular one? What about we do uh, 63 times 67? So, can you automatically get the answer to this? Okay, number above this is 7. 7 6 is a 42. And 7 3 is a 21. That's a really, really cool math trick. You do this one, people think you're a fanatic and genius. You don't even need to hesitate, okay? You do need to set it up a little bit, though, don't you? So, what about, well, I'll give you a bunch of these, see how you go with them, and we'll answer the questions, okay? Uh, we'll go through them. So, what about we do this one? Um, what about 105? Oh, actually, I'm going to change 105. I don't want to do that one, because um, yeah, it's going to be 105 times 105. Let's do 104 times 106. Okay, what about we do uh, 31 times 39, and we do uh, 62 times 68. So, I don't even reckon you're going to need to pause the video to work these out. Let's work them out on the spot. Next number above 10 is 11. 11 by 10 is 110. 6 fours are 24. Okay. Number above this is 4, 4 threes are 12, and then we have 1 times 9, which is 9. Now we write this as 09, because it's the last two digits. Then we go to this one, 6 sixes are, ah, uh, not 6 sixes, 6 sevens are 42. Almost fell for that myself. And then we have 2 eights are 16. Pretty cool, eh? Now, you can incorporate this with a few of the other math tricks which I've got on the videos, and, and you can even start getting a few really, really crazy sorts of things you can apparently work out, yeah? And I'll give you an example of this. So I'll give you the, the really, really hard one. Um, say we do something like, I think we should do this one, 176 times 174. Now, if you've done a couple of my other videos, I'll put the link up, by the way, right now, how you can work out this next number above, which is, we're going to do 18 by 17. So 18 times 17. The answer to that is 306. Okay, there is a little trick, by the way, for working these out. And then we go 6 fours are 24. Okay, the link for how to work out 18 by 17 instantly, by the way, yes, I will put the link up, as I've said. Alright, do you like that trick? 
Obviously, it has a fair degree of limitation, but I think it's a it's, it's just a really interesting little maths trick. So I, I thought I'd put it up because that's what this channel is pretty much becoming all about. Anyway, hope you like that. See you next time.